A police officer's job is to protect and serve the public and their colleagues, right? How does the police officer can build trust? Well, how do police officers build trust? With COVID, the pandemic, and the violence that the kids are seeing on TV. I thought it was important to let everyone discuss their feelings and try to make some sense of all of this. Hello, everybody. Hi. 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 So many people have been like innocently pepper spray and they're just standing there. How much longer? Are the National Guards going to be in California, or, or are they higher than the police? I had received text messages, phone calls from kids, all very confused. One young man who had been through our law enforcement training program um, texted to say that he just didn't think he could trust police anymore, and he didn't know how they would react. So from that, I decided to do um, a town hall meeting, two virtual town hall meetings for the kids and their parents. The first one included law enforcement. The second one included a political figure. And what we wanted to do was to explain to the kids, kind of give them an opportunity to talk about what's going on. And I wanted to talk to them about race and stereotypes and the value of, uh, in, in each human being. Everybody is an individual, and that's how we have to think about this. Our first session was with the law enforcement officers to try to help them understand what they saw on TV. Their question was, why would the police kill George Floyd. There is no reason why George Floyd should have been killed, okay? There were four officers there, four officers. Someone should have stopped that. This is a, a horrible thing that happened. The second one I had was including the political leader because, you know, we've talked about it. Now what, how do we affect a change? What is your opinion on how Things are being handled. How can we make our community much better? I've seen too many riots right. due to racial injustice. And I fear for him being mm -hmm. African American. He's tall, he's brown skin, he has autism. How can we affect the police department to affect more training? What can we do? Keep talking, don't be quiet. Don't let anybody silence you and you can't just talk, we need to vote. We need to come together and support each other. You gotta have faith in mankind. I think that, that the town hall meetings really made a big difference because it gave them an opportunity to talk and share their feelings and get answers. And I wanted my kids to know, you're not a victim in all of this. We're all going through this together and we will get through it. And you have power to make a change.